we are back. You're listening to Conversations with Clark and Gail. That was Trina Braxton, Party or Go Home. That's some serious energy in that thing. Well, you got to, you can't be at the middle of the night sleeping on that one. I, I love it. I listen thank to, you. Uh, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs> and she's, she's in the background. She's saying wiggle, 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 wiggle. <laughs> wiggle, 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 wiggle. <laughs> she's dancing in the background. You definitely have a dance hit on your hands. Anything oh, she dances to becomes a success. Absolutely. Ms. Braxton, is there a video coming out of that single? I can I can kind of see Actually, a serious video of that. Yes, 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 there is. Yes, there is. I just uh, completed filming the video with Derek Blanks, and oh, it's wow. wonderful, and it's fun, and it's saucy. <laughs> and uh, I have this fabulous love interest. It's super fun. It's super fun. I think you guys will really enjoy it. Oh wow! When, when do you, when can we uh, predict that'll be coming out? Uh, in the next couple of weeks. All right, two weeks. Oh, very good, very good. Yes, hey, how yes. does it feel? How does it feel? I was going to say, how does it feel for you being on stage without your sisters? Um, and are they supporting your career now? I know they are. You guys are. The show is so aptly named. Braxton Family Values, and, and I love that about you all. No matter what happens, you all are clearly a unit and will always be that way, and I hate that so many other families out there aren't like that, but hopefully you're having a profound effect in that way on it. But how does it feel not having them there with you on stage? Uh, honestly, at first it was very, very nervous because, like I said before, I'm so used to seeing, you know, to, to my left or to my right, I'm seeing one of my sisters. But now it's like I'm finally there by myself. And But now that I'm getting, you know, accustomed to it and a little bit more acclimated to it, it's just like finally. And it's like a breath of fresh air because I'm doing my kind of music my kind of way. And it's one of the most exhilarating feelings I've ever had in my life. And I'm just like, really, Trina, you really did this by yourself? I'm like, what? And I just want to pat myself on the back and not to sound, you know, conceited. Or anything like that. It's just the fact that I started something and I finished it and I did it on my own. It's the most exhilarating thing in the whole entire world. Yes, it is. Wow. Now I'm going to switch gears a little bit and ask a tough question. Well, please do. Okay. How did the band members react to Tony's comments on Dr. Phil and Tamar's comments about Tony's comments on the show? Um, you know what? Moreover than the band, it was my feeling that was really hurt. Only because when my sister was, when Tony said, you know, oh, well, you know, your band is good. I mean, but they're Cena. They should be playing behind Christina Aguilera. And I'm like, wait, wait, wait now. I am an artist within my own right. Do you guys remember? We've been singing together our whole lives. So why suddenly are you shocked about, you know, the level of professionalism and, and you know, the, the level of greatness that I have as a singer myself. I mean, like, don't get it twisted, y'all. Don't forget, Tony, I'm your background singer for all your life. Don't forget, we've been the Braxton's all of our lives. Come on, sit down, sister. Love you. I have several seats. What would you say? Get your life. <laughs> get right. That's as Tamar would say. Right. <laughs> so what's up next for you? Do you have any shows coming up? And how I can do. I have some shows coming up, and I'm also working on my EP. It should be done by the end of the summer, hopefully. Fingers crossed. So when can people start to, you know, go get some tickets? Yeah. 